So Tanya, talk us through that performance tonight, a 2-1 win against Aston Villa and it means you're in the final four of the competition. Yeah, super effort from the players. I thought um, we've had such a tough day. Um, we've had a tough year, to be honest, and uh, they've played with so much freedom in the cup and it's uh, you know it's a pleasure to, to watch and they played with a smile on their face. Villa threw everything at us tonight and we, uh, you know, we, we held our own and really, really pleased for the players that they've now got a semi-final to look forward to. It's a team that faced a bit of adversity this morning, of course, with um, those announcements of COVID within the squad. But what a performance from, from Benedict this evening. She was superb between the sticks. Yeah, she was brilliant. And um, she's had to wait a long time to get her opportunity. And that's the beauty of, uh, you know, games like this where things don't go your way in terms of uh, in terms of the way you wanted them to you plan them and uh, we've uh, we've adapted we've adjusted we've brought two kids off the bench a 16 year old and an 18 year old and when you compare the changes that Villa were making you know our future is very very bright um, and Benny was fantastic tonight and I'm so pleased for her because she's waited so long for her opportunity and just talk us through the two goals from Ebony the typical Ebony salmon finishes aren't they yeah we spoke to her at half time about you know being a little bit more clinical and um, you know, the first one was, was brilliant and the second one where she's rounded, um, you know, rounded the keeper and finished off is the composure that we've asked from her. So, yeah, brilliant from her, um, you know, but I thought the whole team tonight was exceptional. The changes we had to make, um, everyone that came in did their job and, you know, like I said, really pleased for the players that they've now got a semi-final to look forward to. And just finally looking at that semi-final, there will be at least one championship side in there. Are you looking for that or are you looking for, for one of the big guns, Manchester City or Chelsea? They're still in, of course. Yeah, I think at this point we just take we just take whoever comes along. And, uh, you know, from our perspective, I, I wanted the girls to focus tonight on us and what we were doing and, um, you know, sort of release the shackles a little bit of the league, if you like, um, you know, and, and we'll do the same thing again, you know, no matter who we play. So... Like I said, really pleased for the staff and the players. Um, it's been a really tough season, so this is a, a nice little beacon of light. Well, congratulations.